Hello, everyone. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Hi, Grandma. Oh, no, Grandma. Oh, are your allergies acting up? Oh, no, it's all the dust in the front room. But sweeping makes my back ache. So I've turned a blind eye for... She has a cute little outfit, no months now. I just noticed. But that's exactly what I'm here to help with, Grandma. Then would you mind showing those dust bunnies the front door? There's a broom in my room you can use. You wait out here. Those dust bunnies have no idea what's coming for them. So excited. Sweep, sweep, sweep. I'll have to move this rug to make real headway. Whoa. Suspicious, Grandma. Is that an actual trap door? Jeez, Grandma. What are you keeping down there? Drugs. So, the trap door under the rug. Hmm? What is it for? <laughs> Preserves and pickles? Hmm? Or old machinery? It's not important, honeybee. Will you be out and about tonight? Probably, but I... Could you fetch me some moonflower? It only blooms after some sunset. Moonflower. You'll know it by the white blossoms. See, my moonflower tea blend makes me feel so healthy. I get a blush on these old cheeks. Go right past Parker's workshop into the woods and you'll find what you need. I feel like I'm getting redirected here. I, at my age, it's awfully <laughs> hard to hear certain things. Did you put the rug back in place? Yes, Grandma, but... Uh, but are you brewing moonshine down there? You can tell me if you're brewing moonshine. Mm, I can already taste that tea. That it's was so normal. <laughs> that was normal. Some moonflower. All right. Where are we going? Forest, river, tallest mountain. Make up your mind. Pitta patta, pitta patta, pitta patta. It's early. It's too early for me to do anything here. Let me talk hey, to you. Hey, so my mom says your grandma's sick, and that's why you came here. Yeah, I came back to take care of her. That's nice. I visited my Nona in Italy when she got sick, too. Well, technically, she was my dad's Nona. I'm sure she was really happy to see you. I don't really know. I don't speak Italian, so I didn't know what anybody said. At least you and Hazel speak the same language. That's a good point. Is it time? It's not time yet. 9 a.m. There he is. Mr. Mayor, I have a few questions. Click. Wonderful. The last citizen has let me know that you've been introduced. As promised, here is your reward for playing our little game. We hope it helped you acclimatize. Uh, thanks. Uh, money's great, too, though. <laughs> money, money, money. Hooray! Do you ask every new resident to play the meet everyone game? Oh, yes. After all, that idea won me third place in the Icebreaker Innovation category at the annual mayoral convention. Congratulations. Oh, hush. It's hardly worth mentioning. That's why you mentioned it. Auto soft. It's not nine yet. Hello, let me walk around. Hola. Click. Hey, new girl, how's farm life treating you so far? I'm still figuring everything out. Well, let me know if anyone ever repairs the entrance to the mine by your farm. I run the jewelry shop, but it's a bit hard making jewelry without actual jewels, you know? Crafting beautiful pieces is one thing, but sourcing the stones is tough. I'll let you know. All right, Francis Calderon. Let's hit the jukebox. Okay, make up your mind. 
let's talk to Amira. Hi, Amira. How's the farm? Are you inundated with chores yet? There's not that much to do, honestly. The farm seems so much smaller now that I'm an adult. Hmm. When I first came here, I didn't think I'd have much work either. But living things, plants and people, are always growing, changing, becoming run down. And caring for them takes a lot of time. Interesting. Click. Oh, just who I was hoping to see. Who? Me? Here, take this to Hazel. Oh, I couldn't. Nonsense. Take it. Your grandma and I have a friendly pie rivalry of sorts. This is my answer to her last move. A devastatingly perfect key lime tart. I bake with love, but I also bake to win. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll make sure she gets it. Let me know how she likes it. Hey, have you tried Kim's Butcher Shop yet? There was nowhere on the island to get good bacon until they came along. Now Kai and I can have ourselves a breakfast with the works on the weekends. With the works. Let's go. Just a lot of back and forth, I guess. Talk. Walk around. Talk. If you decide to go into ranching, you can sell me any animals you have. I'll give you cash and some of the meat. Uh. Oh, I guess it's tough coming from the city to learn how the sausage is made. Yes. Yeah, uh, where I come from, it's, uh, it's not talked about so much. I understand. There's lots of stuff we don't talk about in the open here, too. Like what? Yeah, like what? I have to get back to work. Why are you being suspicious, Kim Izumi? Hi, are you settling in okay? No. I'm still figuring out my way around and meeting everyone. Well, take your time. A new town can be overwhelming. And some of the folks here are a little... more overwhelming than others. <laughs> are you talking about yourself? Get back over here. Click. Creepy guy, get away from me. Oh. You're a recent arrival, right? Did Otto have you play that meet everyone game? <laughs> he sure did. But I found it a good opportunity to introduce myself and the League's mission to the town. Before I knew it, I had four new members. Your grandma was always good luck on a boat back in the day. She had a heron's eye for spotting fish. But how can you see fish if they're underwater? <laughs> she hasn't taught you much, has she? Uh, um, no. Potatoes? Here, take this rod. Keep your eyes peeled whenever you're near water for the shadows of swimming fish. When you see them near the surface like that, you know they're feeding. The trick is to get one of them to nibble on your hook instead of the bait fish they're chasing. How do I do that? You'll need some bait. Here are some worms. Hey, you're not the squeamish type, are you? You gotta hook your bait and cast your line. You'll feel when you got one, and then you reel it in. Wait, wait, wait. Back up. How do I cast my line? You'll get the hang of it. The <laughs> lake in the forest is a nice place to start. Uh, but take care, you hear? Don't go in those woods after sunset. I've seen things, well, you wouldn't believe me. My boy Otto didn't either till he saw it for himself. Just stay safe and come back and see me after you've given it a few tries. Any fish, three. Oh, look at the head scratches.
Nope. I know what you must be thinking. Why does old Shelby live in the woods? Oh, well, it's, it's really pretty and it, it's quiet. Don't patronize me, Missy. Truth is, there are riches here the untrained eye can't see. You bring me forageables and I'll pay you fairly for your troubles. I don't mind helping you out. You don't have to pay me. <laughs> I'm a hermit. Not a pauper. Don't need charity from no one. My bones may be getting old, but my mind's as sharp as a... Mm, is I, <laughs> is sharp as a... Attack? Don't interrupt. <laughs> Young folks these days. No respect for their elders. You're crazy. He's crazy. One more mushroom. If you ever have extra baked goods to sell, let me know. I'm always happy to mix things up for my customers. No, thank you. Hello again. Hi. You know, you don't see many blacksmiths these days. Yeah, I know. Well, my great-grandpa was a blacksmith, so I guess you could say it runs in the family. Of course, he died before I was born, but it's his hammer I've got. That's really cool. So your family taught you? Oh, nah, I'm self-taught. A city export like yourself. It's harder work than sitting at a desk, but it's more rewarding. You'll come to love it here. I'll see. Are you thirsty? Water, 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 water. Rice and shine, two out of two mushrooms. All right. Hop. Hop. Oh, never mind. Grandma. Honey. I better not just uh -huh. yet. Grandma. Click. I think I have everything we need. Now I've written down the recipe here. Head on over to the stove. Give it a try. You're so nice to me, Grandma. New recipe. Mushroom. Something. Click the mushroom something. Risotto. Craft. I have mushroom risotto now. I am the mushroom queen. Give the mushroom to grandma. Click. Click. Here you go, grandma. Here's your mushroom risotto. Oh, thank you, honeybee. It welcome. smells wonderful. But you made enough for yourself, I hope. Mm -hmm. Hooray. Oh, here, Grandma. Sophia gave me this pie to give to you. Apple? <laughs> How original. You keep it, honeybee. She doesn't even want it. will give you some energy when you need it. <laughs> Grandma, you... You're spicy sometimes, Grandma. You'll need to go to the woods at night to pick the moonflower. Potatoes will take a while to grow. 
Keep watering them. Every day. I will, Grandma. Get me out of here. Who to be, what to see, what bell to ring. Look, a dead end. <gasps> Vanessa, my love. Good to see you again. You too, Hi. Vanessa. Hi. Have you seen the notice board in front of Town Hall? There are always lots of ways to help out in the community. Is there? No, not yet. Hi. No, I didn't, uh, notice the notice board. Notice well, do take a look. Vanessa. You can lend a hand and make a bit of spare money, too. Don't tell me. I'll make money for us. Hop. So you came here to okay, take just care teleport. of your grandma? That's really nice. Yes, I'm a kind person. You sound disappointed. It's just that it's less fun to prank people who are really nice. I could try being less nice. Thanks, but that's okay. Oh, Louie. Emmy and I already have lots of people to prank. Oh, yeah. Mom says you, you two were friends when you were little. Well, Lena was older, so she kind of used to babysit me. Oh, like Julia does with us. It's not a bad hustle. She gets paid to play with us. For sure. Hazel is a dope old lady. You're lucky having a grandma like that. What, not a big fan of your own grandparents? Um, my mom's parents died when I was little. Mm. And my dad's parents can't visit much because of visa problems. Oh. I'm sorry for bringing it up. Yeah. No, it's, it's cool. Insincere. Hazel's the communal grandma. <laughs> Dead end. Pitta patta, pitta patta. Moonflower. Where is thou, moonflower? Toadstool, peanut. Kitty cat! Purr. Oh, such a pretty girl. Okay, you can't walk on hills. People. Who's there? I probably shouldn't spy on strange people creepily creeping through the woods at night. No. Run away. This is where I would run away. <gasps> Come along, oh, Elder Hazel. Him. Don't rush me. I'm coming. Grandma! <gasps> where did she go? She shouldn't be out here at night. No. Elder uh -huh. Hazel, this is the third time you've come to the circle without your robe and mask. This is an unacceptable risk. Ah, it's time for us to come out of hiding. The town you won't tell be afraid of witches if they know that we're their neighbors. Witches? Seem nice until the day comes when they need a scapegoat for their troubles. Then people become mobs. Well, I didn't bring Terra here so she could skulk around like Look she's how terrified doing I am. something I'm wrong terrified. just by being who she is. So you, you tell think him, your Grandma. intuition was right then? She has the gift? When will she be ready to join us? Join them? Did you hear something? Uh-oh. Run! Wait till Grandma returns to ask her about the forest. Confirm. Let's get out of this creepy forest with this creepy cat staring at the creepy forest mass people. Ah, uh, tree! Ah! Sorry, I lost my composure. 
this creepy light. Creepy flower bed. Creepy brick road. Steeped in mystery. Uh, still need potatoes. Fishies. Pride flag. Ah, oh, suspicious. You're just sitting out here on a bench, huh? All by yourself. Are you one of them? <laughs> Get me out of here. Get me out of here. This is all a dream. I want to go home. Wake up in Kansas, Toto. Oh. I need a fish. Three worms. Whoop. <laughs> gotcha. Fishing take away all my troubles of me being a witch. Studfish, array, finned fish. Click. One more. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, fishies. Come on. Come on, fishies. You know me. You know I just want to capture you so I can eat you. Yes, fishies. Select. Wabba. Oh. Um, 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 um. Gotcha! Midnight. Don't drop my slipper. Let's go home. I gotta go home. My dress will disappear and you'll see that I'm actually really ugly inside. Oh, am I ready for bed? Yeah, we ain't waiting for grandma. I'm get out of here. I'm done. <sighs> okay. <laughs> 